My name is Onyeka Kuma and I'm the founder and CEO of Farm Crowdy, a digital agriculture platform that connects small-scale farmers with investors for the purpose of boosting food production in Nigeria. Um, Farm Crowdy has um, pretty much set up, um, we went live in November 2016 and from that time to now We've had Nigerians excited about the agriculture space because they are now investing through our platforms and we're able to use that money in order to grow food for millions of people around the country. So the way Farm Crowdy works, I mean, it came out of my own problem that I was facing. So in 2015, uh, as, as many people as were excited about investing in agriculture, I was one of those people. And I was looking at how I could find the right farmer to invest in. And while doing that research, I found out that farmers had three main problems, access to funds, technical know-how, and the market to sell their farm harvest. On the other hand, you had millions of people like me that were excited about investing in agriculture, but didn't know the farmers they could trust, didn't know the farmers they would get updates from, and didn't know farmers that would eventually return their investment, not to talk of uh, getting some, some return after the harvest. We're barely 22 months old. Um, we, we don't consider ourselves profitable today. I mean, not that we can't find profit. There are opportunities where we have seen uh, profitability come into play, but it's not at a full-blown scale. And so we won't say we are profitable today, but we are working towards that. Now, you can either, we can either stay at the level we want to stay at today, where we've worked with the number of farmers we've worked with and done the work we've done till date and optimize that model and do not scale and optimize mainly for profit. But today we're reinvesting our resources in, in order to scale our operations to attract more people. There are over 38 million small scale farmers in Nigeria today. Um, the figures are all over the place, but we can sit around that for now. And with us working with only 7,000 in the first 22 months, it tells you there's a huge opportunity for us to continue to increase our impact. And so if we stay at this level and decide it's all about profit, um, we won't be able to have the scale we're excited about. So for now, um, we're optimizing our model, we're keeping our eyes on increasing our profit margins over time, but we are also all about scaling and having more impact in farmers' lives that we work with. I think it's because of the the, 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 the opportunity where people now have um, of doing good while doing well, where you're not just making money for making money's sake any longer. You're now making money while partnering with a farmer that you're changing his life. An average farmer comes on Farm Crowdy. I mean, for instance, the farm we went and did a farm tour with a couple of sponsors in the media crew too. The farmer started with 2,000 birds. They stayed on 2,000 birds, grew to 2,500, and they were almost bankrupt. Yet they had a pen that could take more than 20,000 beds. But access to funding, the right technical know-how, access to market was a major hindrance to them. Well, Farm Crowdy now is in Quara State. I'm from Quara State. I'm excited about the fact that they're working with 2,000 or 800 farmers in Quara State. Uh, so they just get emotional about it while making money because it's not just getting emotional and donating. You're making money in the process. I think that's just... Um, I think that's the biggest push we've been seeing, helping us to grow our impact and continue to have a lot of footprint. The way we've been able to drive traffic to our platform has been um, pretty much some of the conventional ways people have done this, where we, we uh, do the regular digital marketing exercises, search engine optimization, we have a website, we have a mobile app. I'll speak about the mobile app last, but you have a website and so you build uh, some social media presence and you're able to tell a story about why we are doing what you're doing. That has been one of the major reasons we've been able to drive traffic. In another five years, um, we want to place Farm Crowdy at a position where we're maybe one of the uh, top five um, food producing companies in, the con in, in Africa where we, we are able to uh, work with farmers and enable them to produce not just enough to boost food security in Nigeria but across the continent. Everywhere there's an opportunity where uh, uh, an opportunity where uh, small-scale farming 
support for that is still unstructured, it becomes an opportunity for us at Farm Crowdy. And this is where we want to be in five years from now, um, touching the lives of more than a million farmers, um, helping them to either provide funding um, in form of uh, the right input, provide technical know-how, or provide market access for the farmers to, to sell at the right price and make a decent margin for farming as a business. And so five years from now, that is what we want to be. Maybe we're among the top five uh, producers of food on the continent. Not because we have the largest farms, but because we're touching, we have the largest pool of farmers that are working with us to continue to produce the food that they produce for us to eat. Thank you.